When you think about Mean Girls, you think pretty, pink, and preppy. Typically rich, popular, and fashion icons. After making so much research on the early 2000s style and hundreds of other movies, watch me and my friends fully transformate ourselves into plastics. Broly said I should wear a mini skirt, so I wore it. One time she punched me in the face. It was so nice. Rally always uses lip covers, so I got me some. Rally says she likes girls with faces, so I got them. Rally started saying slay, so I did it. Slay. Rally said we look like a, a good couple, so now we're eating. Rally said that she likes skaters, so I learned how to skate. Rally said I must get locks, so I got locks. Rally is a clown, so I'm always going to the circus. Hi, Rolly is my friend now. He's lying. Um. Um, guys, I've been thinking about making this video for a very long time. It's been in my vision board, in my head. And I was like, you know what? Only a few years, few months left of high school. And high school content is temporary. You won't always be able to make content in high school. So just like, you know what? Let me give you guys some nice content. So basically, we're going to be recreating the scenes from Mean Girls, dressing up as Mean Girls. Um, I just want to put out a full disclaimer before i start this video firstly it's literally just content it's really not that deep i am no way in any shape or form trying to what's that word trying to make it look like being a mean girl is something we should romanticize i feel like we're totally out of that day age and era and being a mean girl nowadays makes you ugly disgusting and not cool so i'm not saying being a mean girl is cool in any shape or form it's not and i don't think i am a mean girl and if i am you probably deserve that shit. <laughs> i'm joking i'm joking <laughs> Um, if it's your first time seeing this lovely face, hi, my name is Roy. I love creating different content and you really don't want to miss out on that. So please make sure you subscribe. Um, without any further ado, let's get straight into the video. So the kind of look that I'm going for, I'm wearing like a golf shirt. Ne? So it's more, Regina George was more like a laid back kind of like, you know, like just, she just put on anything and she just made it work. That's not me, sadly. I have a specific body and I have to dress for my body. So if I don't wear things the way I'm, so I can't wear those tanks, guys. You know, I can't wear, <laughs> I can't wear tanks. So I was just like, you know what? I do have a cropped golf shirt. Um, secondly, she didn't really wear jewelry, but I wanted to turn it into more of a preppy kind of look or turn her aesthetic into more preppy because if I didn't do anything, it really wasn't gonna make a statement or like do anything. Let me show you guys this very cute jar that I have. It's literally in a hard shape and I literally made it from this candle that my bestie once got me. Lip liner. Um, I've literally been so obsessed with lip liner, guys. Someone told me to stop. I can't stop. It's become my whole identity. Like, lip combos are just the thing. And mine's actually not lip combo, it's just lip liner. And I use this black from this palette, right? It's sad because most of the time I can't go with this whole palette to school. So it's like only there for like the morning. <laughs> From the morning until break, after break, the lip liner is gone. But it really lasts compared to like actual lip liner. It lasts. And uh, I personally like the black. I don't always like black. But when you put effort in the little things, like trust me, it's going to give people a statement that you actually wanted to be there. You showed up and you understood the assignment type thing. Um, I recently got this Dior blush. I'm literally so obsessed with it, guys. You don't get it. Like, like thing is, I don't know if it's real. I don't know how you guys can tell if it's real or not. But basically, I got it from my cousin. And long story short, it's like, it's like, it's this is so much proof that this is probably real. Like, I got it from like people. <laughs> I can't even explain how I got it. Point is, we got this blush, and there's a high possibility it's real. And I'm so happy she gave it to me because, like, blush is my entire personality. And I want to have more of these. These are so nice. I'm so tempted to use a liquid blush, but no makeup is allowed. So, I'm not going to. 
it doesn't really do much hey i feel like it's more for like people with lighter skin i don't know if you guys can notice any difference i, I can sort of yeah i can notice this, the difference i don't know if you guys can see the difference on the camera like literally i feel like a bobby girl right now um this body mist pink jasmine rebus this is the mini skirt that i'm going to be wearing later on it like it will complete the outfit trust me um, okay there isn't proper lighting in my room right now but i finished changing this is what my hair looks like the outfit these pants mom these boots boots always and then the golf shirt that i'm talking about this is so weird <laughs> Look at my little sister. You look like a little cheesy Joe. I don't know who influenced her to me this mountain. All this just become a little rolly slash slash. Okay, I'm gonna do a little school vlog for you guys so that you know school's always nice and they're always interesting things that we're doing there. And then um later on after school we'll do the recreating the scenes. Hi guys! Where is she? Come on, video. Vlogs by really guys. I did her. Look at her. Pretty guys. Pretty. Really said I should go to a new school. So he went to a new school. Um, yo, the way I've changed and I've changed. And I've changed. It's not even funny. I was wearing a mini skirt. Oh, I saw you guys wearing makeup. That was so funny. You guys look nice. Thank you. Yo, guys, the looks are good. The looks are good. There wasn't even things. <laughs> guys, okay, so basically, we've been filming like individual scenes now. Work. I lost my mic thing. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> That another disclaimer before y'all start watching these scenes like i said these scenes don't mean anything we're not mean girls and it's just for content yeah enjoy that day I wore a vest because that vest was disgusting you can't sit with us what's wrong with you why are you acting weird why are you just like us those rules are so you can't sit with us. <laughs> I can't go out <clears throat> I'm sick I can go out <clears throat> I'm sick Ow. do you know what everyone says about you they say that you're a homeschooled jungle freak who's a less hot version of me yeah <laughs> Do you know what everybody says about you? They say you're a homeschool jungle freak who's a less hot, <laughs> who's a less hot version of me. Who are the plastics? They're teen royalty. That one there, that's Karen Smith. She is one of the dumbest girls you will ever meet. And that little one, that's Gretchen Wieners. Gretchen Wieners knows everybody's business. She knows everything about everyone. That's why her hair is so big. It's full of secrets. Um, what's happening? And evil takes a human form in Regina George. Well, I'm before, because she may seem like your typical selfish, backstabbing, slut faced hoe bag, but in reality, she is so much more than. It's a fun night. Okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> um, Rolly said I must wear a miniskirt, so I did. No, you didn't try it. <laughs> 